it's Q-Tip, and today I'm going to be doing some more Buckyballs like I did in the last episode. Um, in the last episode I did a spherical object, and yeah, so I decided to get do Buckyballs again because I thought people would like it. And, um, yeah, so right here we have uh, just all my Buckyballs in 100, 100, 216. And they're just getting an object, and I'll show you how to make, uh, I'll just show you how to make one simple thing of this, because today we're going to be doing, like, I just call this the magic trick, I don't know, I don't know, I just don't know. So, what, so take all, you have to have 216 for this, so you get, get two, so you get, you count 18, 18 buckyballs, and you're going to count six, one, two, three, four, five, six, and you're going to fold it on to the sixth one. So it's like that. And, like, and then, whoops, one, two, three, four, five. Sorry, my mistake. Okay, and then we're just gonna wrap it. So, so, sorry, my wrapping skills are kinda hard on camera. Wrapping skills, haha. -ha. Uh, gosh, this one's stick, come on. Come on, stick, yeah, there we go. And we're just going to wrap it. Simple. Just like keep wrapping it. Let me get the camera to focus. There we go. So now it should look like this with the hole in it. And that's what these are all. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to... here. That Okay. So after you use all of them, don't put it into this. Because I'm going to cut this all up into pieces. some stuck over here or oh, just cut off too I feel like I should be a chef think about that my chopping skills are very good all right so you should cut them all up into small pieces and this is what I have so So you get all of them. What we're gonna do is we're gonna put them, line them up, and we're gonna. So what? So okay. So we're gonna all make them into this. So we just all connect them like that. So. And if they don't, if like let's say, if you try connecting it and it just goes on like that, instead of on perfectly like that, just pull it off and flip it over like that, and then stick it on. And we're just going to keep getting all of them and lining them up like that. So, yeah. I thought this would be kind of fun. It's it's kind of hard to do at first, and then it gets easier after the third time. And what I mean by that, I'll show you in a sec. So, anyway, guys. Um, I don't know. Sorry for the background noise. But okay. So. Anyway. Uh, yeah. So we have a long row. And what we're going to do is we're going to cut this into threes. So what we're. So. You take this. I see, and we're going to all put that like that. Sorry, I'm try I'm kind of listening to their conversation. They're like, "You unlock the door." Okay, so we have all this in the three, and make sure it's important to have them all in like this. Sorry, the light's not really in the way. So, yeah, so we have them all like four like this, and what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this, these um, tops right here, and we're gonna fold it over. This is kind of hard at first, and you're, we're gonna fold it over, and be careful to hold it because. Oh yeah, and when you so you make sure to hold it, and it'll connect automatically into this like octopus shape. So we have this and this. So that's really cool. I like I like that form. So here's the octopus, I guess. Sorry, it's upside down because I'm right there. So yeah, and now what we're gonna do is we're gonna 
um, what I do is I, so, okay, so after you have this, you, this part right here, you're going to open, this is the hard part, so, find a circle, open these two, and we, um, open these two right here, this one, and that one, and we, and we have it like this so these two are connected and these two are connected so hold this and now we do the same thing on this one just kind of fold it back like that and they will get stuck this one i think is the hardest to do but once you do it should look like this flip it over oh shoot and they're easy to take apart kind of ish so once you have that you can just take your one finger be careful at the first time you just take them all and push it like that so yeah that's fun to do and you after that you can take it and do that but since that didn't really work just do this there you go so that's basically that's why I had it like this so I'm gonna do it one more time and I'm going to not stop and it's kind of confusing I'm sorry it's this is probably for more of uh, people who don't, like not beginners. I mean, I I'm kind of a beginner. I don't know how to explain it. No offense. So yeah, let me just do that real quick. I'm gonna do it one more time. That's stopping. I already said that. I already said that. Okay. So. I didn't actually originally create this. I just got it from a YouTuber or thing. On um, somebody or something. I can't remember her name. But anyway, if you want to see the original video, I'll leave the link in the description. And yeah, so we have all this again. Okay, here we go. See, it gets stuck like that. Kind of annoying. Sorry, give me that second. It, this is hard. Like, it's stuck. I don't get it. There we go. See, it just forms like that. So it's kind of hard for me. Sorry, I, I, I it was just forming. That's all. So I don't know if you guys can see it, but there's a line right here. Kind of looks like the top of a pokeball. Sorry, I stopped. <laughs> so you just open this part, this line part. So if you guys didn't know, same thing on the other one. And there you go. So I thought that was kind of fun. And yeah. So if you guys want to check this out, uh, try it. So I don't know if you if you lose one. I don't know if it's going to work or not. It just depends. And I will leave some more Buckyballs stuff to do in the description. So if you guys want to check that out. Or if you guys want to... If you guys want to see more Buckyball videos, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Leave a like, comment, and I will see you guys all next time. Goodbye. Goodbye.